What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moodle WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to apply a slider made using Smart Slider WordPress plugin into your WordPress pages or posts in a simple, fast and free method using any page builder that you like. So no need to use Elementor or WP Bakery or just Gutenberg, you can use whatever you want. In the previous guide that I'm gonna leave a link in the description below in a card over here, we did learn how to install Smart Slider. And after install, of course, you wanna know how to create your sliders. The process is simple and we're gonna document it in the next video. But first of all, let's apply the slider that came with the plugin to your pages. So we can start editing the sliders and reviewing the results in the final page of your site front end. Open the smart slider, click in edit after hovering and scroll down until you find the option to copy the short code. After that, go to your WordPress page, add new and post this smart slider tree slider and the slider number. Once this is the first slider, the number is one. And if you go to the preview or update or create the page and review it, you can see the slider already on it. Just copy the short code and post onto the page. Now let me show you the process while using WP Bakery Page Builder. Go to your WP Bakery editor, back end or front end, click on the plus button, find out the text block element, delete the contents on it and post the smart slider short code. Let's preview exactly the same results from Gutenberg. Now let's apply it using Elementor WordPress plugin. I'm gonna activate Elementor just to use this tutorial, just to make this tutorial. It's recommended that you have only one page builder activate on your site, so if you activate Elementor, deactivate any other page builder, and the opposite. Now, go to Pages, add new, edit with Elementor, so we can load up the Elementor front-end editor. Click on the plus button, select a unique column into the plus, drag and drop the text editor element. Now. Just post the plugin short code. This is the default slider that came when you install the plugin, so you can get the short code from the beginning. And as you can see, we have the slider using any page builder that we like. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmoto.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes with full compatibility to Smart Slider 3 WordPress plugin. And I see you later. All the best!